Yo, what is up guys? Welcome to a brand new video in Pokemon Revolution Online. In the last video, we got ourselves our third gym badge and defeated LT Surge. Our Pokemon are looking pretty good. These are our, um, can we pull them all at the same time? I guess we cannot pull them all at the same time. But we got Raticate here, Badu is looking good, Charmander is looking great, and Gyarados is looking even better. Our Pokemon are just, they're just doing really, really good. Um, I've also added a Pikachu to our team not to actually use, but this Pikachu is for, um, you guys will see today. today Today's episode, we're going to be trying to get Flash and then going through Rock Tunnel. So, um, I guess the first thing we need to do is try to get Flash, which is just located um, over this direction, over this way. So, um, I think we got to go through Diglett Cave. Let me make sure that I even have some repels on me. I do have 10 repels. So, that should be enough repels to get us to where we need to go if we just keep those oh, present there for some reason. But I think um, this guy should let us pass this time. Okay, he let us pass. And I think this is going to let us go into this. Yeah, right here it is. There's a guy standing here. Is he blocking it? Huh, have you heard? There's a weird dude that gives Flash on the other side of Diglett's cave. Racing you there, Slowpoke. Yeah, I guess we're racing that guy for some reason. We are racing that guy. There's a Poke stop there, but they never work, so I'm not even going to try that one. Not even going to try that one. Um, Alright, so wait, we have Dig now. Can we do these Dig spots? Oh. Oh, we can actually do the Dig spots now, dude. Check that out, that's pretty cool. Hey, Raticate gets level 34 from that battle. Let's hit these dig spots and see if we can find anything cool in them. Oh, we we just found a dome fossil. What? So this is how you get the fossils and stuff in the game. I need to put on some repels. We got a flying gem from that one, and then the last one here. Let's see if we can get anything good. Oh, it's a Pokemon. We found a Reaper Cloth in that dig. What? Dude, can you just find anything in these? Found a Pokeball in that one. It's so random whatever you can find, dude. Another Reaper Cloth. What in the world? Dude, Brock's in Diglett Cave doing something in here. I wonder how we get up there. I didn't even see. All right, looks like we made it to the end of Diglett Cave, which it was pretty short, which I'm actually happy about because usually Diglett, Diglett's Cave is a longer cave in most games. So I'm glad that I was able to get a shorter cave there. And is this the house? I think this is not the house. Ooh, berries. Yeah, what's this one? Citrus berries, baby. That's what we want to see right there. We can put those on our Pokemon, but I think this is where you can trade for Mr. Mom or something. Actually, there's nobody in here. This is my house. Now, I claim this house. All right. Um, no more repels. I think this is where we're going to be able to, yeah, talk to Professor Oak's aide here. Howdy. How's your adventure going? Have you caught 10 different species of Pokemon? Yes. Professor Oak wanted me to give you this HM. You have received HM Flash. Yeah, so you have to be able to catch um, 10 um, Pokemon, I guess. Let's see how many I've actually caught. I don't know how many I've caught so far. I have caught... 15 different kinds of Pokemon. I did catch a few of them. I guess I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight of them in my party, anyways, if you count the evolutions and stuff. Because it counts evolutions. What does this guy here want? Uh, I knew you would come here. And I knew you would trade your Abra for Mr. Mime. Wait, do I? I don't even think I have an Abra, do I? Yeah, I don't even have. I, think, I don't have one on me, but I don't know if I have an Abra. Um, I think I might have caught one. I think it might have been a different game. I don't know, I get all the MMOs confused when playing them back to back, so um, maybe one day I'll come back and trade for that Pokemon. Alright, so we can go back through the tunnel and get to Vermilion City, or we can go this way and we can check out some stuff. Now, if I remember correctly, I'm pretty sure this goes back to Pewter City, and I think we can use Cut up here to get into the back of the museum like in the original Pokemon games, and if we can, I think we can get the Amber, the old Amber that way, and that can get us Aerodactyl in the future. Um, and Aerodactyl's a really, really good Pokemon, so let's see if we can break in that way. All right, I don't think you can actually get the old Amber from this place this time, so um, maybe I already have it, actually. Wait, where did I get a Helix Fossil? Oh, yeah, I got that from the from the cave before, so I have a Dome Fossil and a Helix Fossil now. That's pretty good. We have two of the Kanto um, Pokemons. Maybe we can find old Amber. I think I'm going to go back through Mount Moon just so I can hit up those dig spots and get the free items and stuff from those guys, so... Let's go to Mount Moon really quick, get the dig items, and then we'll head our way through Rock Tunnel after we get through Cerulean City. That is the plan. Um, I guess I can go ahead and teach Flash to Pikachu while I'm at it. Um, I don't know which Pokemon can learn Flash, but I don't want to teach any of them that because teaching them HMs is just pointless. So there we go. Pikachu now knows Flash, and we can easily get through the Rock Tunnel there. There's an Abra right here. We could just steal that Abra and teach it to that, or trade it to that guy for the Mr. Mom or whatever. All right, we are in Mount Moon. I'm going to make sure that I have my repels on for this one. Hopefully, we only have um, eight repels left, so hopefully that's enough to get us through. I'm going to try to speed through as fast as I can while also still getting all of the um, good old dig spot things here. Oh, we got a Moonstone from this one, boys. That's pretty cool. Oh, a rare candy from that one. I think that's our first rare candy in this entire game, so... 
I think I'm gonna set those to the very end when we're fighting the Elite Four. Probably the best thing we can do. We got a Dark Gem and we got one more dig spot here to check. And another Dark Gem. That's pretty cool. Oh, we got an Old Amber from that one. I didn't show it because I pushed Spacebar too fast. But we got an Old Amber. That means we have all of the fossil Pokemon from Generation 1. That's pretty cool. All right. And we have made it out of Mount Moon. Um, now we just got to go through Cerulean City. And then we just keep going um, east. And then we should make our way to a little tree cutting spot. And that's where we can make our way over to um, Rock Tunnel's entrance. And that is where we're going to start. Today's actual part of the video, I guess, just going through there and just doing whatever we can do. And if we're going through Rock Tunnel, we might as well stock up on repels because you know it's going to be a long and tedious trip. So let's just buy a few of these. I think 20 should be good for just 7,000. Not a bad deal. All right, now if we just head east through this area with this little picket fence, we will make our way over to Route 9. And this is where we can start or making our way toward the entrance of Rock Tunnel. There's a few trainers we got to battle here, so let's go ahead and talk to these guys first and just go ahead and battle them. Like always, I will skip the battles unless something cool happens so that way you guys don't have to be like bored by watching me do all these stupid battles. Here is another one of those Trial Master dudes. So I'm guessing this is like a quest that's going to happen in the future or a quest that's not finished yet that they're working on. I'm really excited to see what that's going to be about. Ooh, berries. Oh, there was a trainer hiding behind a tree there. All right, we'll get the berries after the trainer. All righty. Um, we got more citrus berries, um, more pecha berries, and then one of these red ones here. Lepa berries, nice, nice. All right, let's continue adventuring. Wait a minute, is that Ash Ketchum? I remember last time he destroyed us, I think. Um, but our Pokemon are basically dead right now, so I'm going to go heal up and then come right back. And we're going to try to defeat Ash this time. He will not have the best of us again. All righty, we are able to defeat Ash Ketchum now, hopefully defeat Ash Ketchum. Um, we're going to lead with, uh, let's just lead with Eradicate. Um... Because I don't really know what he's going to have on his team. Ah, uh, you didn't you didn't see me in Viridian Forest right now, my pal Pikachu. Shame. Oh, uh, wait. Maybe I have to defeat him there. I don't know if I would beat him there last time or not. I could have swore I talked to him there and lost to him. All right. Maybe we'll have to go back to that guy eventually. But right now, we ain't doing that quest. Oh, I found a Pokeball in this tree. <laughs> I didn't know you could find out about that. That's pretty cool. Um, I think I defeated every single trainer on that route. And that's the end of that route, basically. Um, so... I think, yeah, here's the Pokemon Center in the next area that we can go to. Oh, look at those windmills, dude. Those Magnemites. Down south from here is the uh, Pokemon Power Plant. I'm not sure, like, what... Uh, if Zapdos is there or not, but I'm sure in the future we'll figure that out. All right, let's go ahead and heal up really quick. I still don't have enough badges required to claim any free items. How many badges do you need? All of them? I have no idea, dude. There's another one of those holes. Okay... Okay, so I think this is like a shortcut you can use once you figure out, so you can like get through the tunnel a lot faster. That's pretty cool. Let's see when we get to the end of the cave, if we can find another hole and like com and see if we can combine those, and maybe we can get a shortcut through Rock Tunnel. That'd be pretty cool. But I think that's gonna be it for today's Pokemon Evolution Online video. I've been recording for almost 40 minutes now, so hopefully y'all know how to get Flash. In the next episode, we will go through Rock Tunnel and get to Lavender Town, the scary, spooky ghost town. So. I guess it's going to be it for today's video. If you guys have done today's video, please leave a like, subscribe, comment. As always, I will see you in the next one. God bless you. Thank you for watching.